What's up YouTube land is Junior aka Semi and this is Semi 2 Tech Bring you another great video guys a great one to this channel And I'm glad you're here to enjoy this video and before we get started make sure you guys go hit that subscribe button Enable bell notifications Share the video and like this video and among all my videos I upload so make sure you still stay updated with me because I bring a lot of great videos and this is another great one. If you haven't done so already, right here, the subscribe button right here, click on that. And once you click on that, you make sure you click right next to it, the little bell right here. Enable bell notifications so you get notified for every single video I come out with and or anything I come out else I come out with. As well as don't forget to like the video there and share it to your all your social media platforms. Also, if you do want to keep in touch with what I do and what's going on in life with me, make sure you, you subscribe to all my social media accounts. I have them all listed down below. And if you do like gaming, also check out my other two channels, which is on Twitch and Mixer, which is also Semi2 Tech. Just check them out. I have those links below as well, guys. Make sure you guys check me out all this stuff because I bring a lot of great content. I'm going to be bringing gaming here too. But I go more live on them with when it comes to gaming over there. So go ahead and check those out for me if you guys want to go check out gaming. And so today I'm going to bring you a great, great, great product review that I think is a great product. And just is that simple. It's just a great product. I did, did a, a video on this on my old channel. So I'm just going to re-upload. I'm going to edit it and re-upload it here so you guys could check it out. It's a great product. Um, really... It's an awesome, awesome product. I think you should guys get it. It's just my opinion. It might help a lot of people. It might not. For me, I don't use a product anymore because I did change my whole setup differently. That it doesn't require me to use it or need to use it. Not not use it. Not need to use it. And so, but I still have it in case I do get another setup. I want to get a smaller desk and this will work. A different setup will be smaller. But that's why I'm still keeping it. And it's a great product, guys. So, so make sure you guys do all what I just say. Go check me out. Follow me on all my social medias and other channels. So you get updated to all the latest and greatest. And let's get forward with the video. All right, guys. Thanks for coming back. I do appreciate all the love and support you guys show me the channel. Just like I told you recently right now, to support the channel, all you got to do to help support the channel, the free way, free easy way, take you less than 30 seconds, is share my videos like all my videos and comment on my videos guys that's all you need to do take your less than 30 seconds and while you're doing that if you haven't done so already you can go ahead and subscribe to the channel because it's a great channel to subscribe to and enable bell notification that is the easy free way to support the channel and yes it takes you less than 30 seconds to do all four steps five steps if you enable bell notifications but that's it guys that's all you need to do to support the channel and if you want to support the channel just a little bit more, you know, help the channel as much as you can. If you want to, it's not, it's not required. It's always appreciate, but never require or request it. It's your mother welcome to make a small donation to the channel. Anything helps. You guys have seen before, I've shout out to people that have donated to the channel. I acknowledge everybody that does it to donate, and I do appreciate everybody that donates. And all you have to do is check out those links down below to the cash up and PayPal links. And that's it. That's very last all you got to do, guys. Again, thank you so much for everybody supporting the channel. All right. So today I'm bringing another great video. It's not another APK. It's not another iPhone app. It has nothing to do with electronics somewhat. <laughs> so this is a product review I'm doing of something I use and I enjoy using. And I was looking for it for a long time and I finally found something that makes it. It's this great right here PC mount. It is a mount that you can mount your PC underneath the table and keep it off the floor. All right. And you're asking yourself, why would you need, why would you want to do that? Why don't you just mount it on top of the TV? I mean, on top of the TV, mount on top of the desk or, or, or leave it on the floor. All right. So when it comes to PCs, especially the one that I have, it's a, it's a gaming PC. It's a very powerful PC. And when you have a powerful PC, the main key of keeping your computer running perfect is keeping it cooled down. So that means good airflow. So if, if I put it on top of the desk, yes, I'll get the airflow I need, but I lose desktop space. You know, 
I have a pretty big desk, and and it still takes and that, and I still think that takes up too much space for me to keep on top of the desk. I have a five foot desk, um, but I also have a forty nine inch ultra wide monitor, guys. So it does take up a lot of my desk space, and I would like to have desk space so I can put other stuff on there. Like I have my PlayStation on there, I have all my print on there now since I removed the the PC. Uh, I have three monitors, the 49 inch and the two 27 inches on top. So I do take up a lot of my space on my desktop already and it, it feels overcrowded when I had my PC on top of there. So here you can see my PC is very crowded. You see the towers on the right hand side, the two monitors on top and you see the 49 inch on the bottom. Yes, excuse the mess. So you see it's pretty crowded there. So that's how I first had it. Had it there for a while like that, made it work. And then I switch it around. And then you're gonna see right about now that I did switch around, I put the PC in the back of the screen. I made it work a little better as you see the places in there. So it's still crowded. I still wanted more space in the front of the PC because right now I have to push the screens up a little bit so I have no more keyboard space for myself. So that really took up a lot of space for me. So I my only option is to remove the tower down and push everything back so I have more space for myself. And I don't put it on the floor because I do have carpet in my bedroom, which I have, that's where my studio is, bedroom slash studio. <laughs> and so it's carpet, so if I put it on the floor, it doesn't get airflow from the bottom as much, it's, it's very restricted. So I was looking for a way to keep, still have the desk space, but um, keep it nearby. So I was looking around, searching, searching. I found this this mount right here from Vivo. It's a mount, Vivo Mount PC01. That's the model number. It's a mount that you can mount underneath your desk and keep the keep the um, the PC floating on the off the off the floor. So it still gives you the airspace in the back you need, the airflow on top, and the airflow on the bottom. Because I do have three vents: bottom, top, and back. I don't have any on the side, both sides are enclosed, no airflow through there, but this is great. And with this mount, you're also able to rotate it. So very small, it looks very small, but it expanded. I'll show you when I'm doing our boxing. It's a great mount, It's from, like I said, it's from Vivo. I do have a Vivo um, monitor mount, which is awesome. So Vivo does make sturdy products. So this is something I do recommend people get it, if you're gonna get mounts for any kind of PC mounts and everything, Vivo is a reputable company, which is like comparing Toyota, I mean, to Honda to, to Hyundai. Yeah, they sound the same, but they're not the same car. Of course, people are gonna choose Honda over Hyundai. Um, some people might choose Hyundai, but that's personal preference. I personally think Honda is a more reputable company, it's been around longer, and it's long lasting. So yeah, guys, this is it right now, so I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. I'm gonna get this open up real quick. You know what? Let me bring you in closer so you can see everything that's going on, all right? So let's get to it and bring you up close. All right, guys, so I'm right here on my, on my desktop so you can see. So this is how it comes in. It's all packaged into one bag, as you can see. This is the mount. You're like, how is that gonna hold the PC? It looks so small. Let's check it out and see what's in, let's see what it is, all right? So I'm gonna grab this bag, move this out of the way. All right, so we have the mount here. Not too big, it doesn't look too big. And of course, here you have the manual. It tells you how to install it, what features it has. You can go through it, but it's pretty much explanatory how to do it by when you touch it. it tells you what comes inside the box, everything, how to mount in. And the good thing with this mount too, if you have no walls, you can actually rotate the, the PC if you want. You can put it in any direction. So if you want to flush it in the back, you can flush it in the back. You want to flush on the side, you can flush on the side, which that's what I'm planning to do, put it on the side. So it's flush with the wall of the desk and it looks more cleaner and more, more leg space for me. All right, so we got the book there. We're going to put this to the side because we don't need it. So this is it. So we're going to open this up. All right. So I see that all the screws came out of here. All right. So we're going to move this bag out of the way. So this is the mount here. This was the bag of two of, of bolts, which they all came out of here. So 
you got mounts, you got bolts here. All these bolts for different, depending on the desk you have and what you want to use it for. You want to mount it underneath like a something else. It has long screws, it has short screws, it has cushioning pad tabs. But all these stuff will be included. Even got drywall, drywall um, screw holders. So, so let me put this back in the bag because I'm not gonna need it right now. I'm gonna show you more of the of the PC holder, how everything works. All right, so, because this all, it brings the tools you need. You see the Allen key that you need to adjust the mount. Bring, let me bring all this out. All right, so I got the screws that fell in here. It's all right, let me see if I can get these screws out. All right, so the screws did come out. They were all stuck inside, but it's all right, guys. For some reason, the bag was left open. But this is how normally your bag will, of to, uh, tools will come in. Just like this, all the screws, your Allen key, that's how it comes in. So if you need anything, there you go. All right, so you mount it here. You see the mount here. It has the Vivo logo there. All right. And, oh, there's still a screw in there. That's where I'll get that out in a second. So this is how the look the mount looks when you first get it. This small. And you see there's a screw here with the Allen key. Let me see if it's loose. Yeah, it's loose, so I don't have to use the Allen key right now. But when you mount the Allen key, you, you wanna, so you take this bolt out and you adjust it to the height of your desk. All right, there you go. So you adjust it to the height of, the, of your desktop. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna just say I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna mount it here. And then once you adjust the mount of the of the width of the width of your of your desk, let's see. I gotta get it right. Now. Oops. Sorry, sorry for the big loud noise, guys. I was just trying to get the screw in the proper way, in the proper hole. That came out wrong, but it's okay. All right. So once you get the screw in, you see that it, it's tight. If you want to make it more secure, there's this bolt right here. Your screw, it's a, it's a regular Phillips head screwdriver, a screw right there. Put it tighter and put it smoother for you. Now, one thing that I did not know, uh, did I not show you? Let's say you wanna use this mount and mount your PC on the wall. It has four holes right here, two here and two here. So you're able to screw this directly on the wall if you don't wanna mount it on the bottom of your PC. So you're able to mount it right on the wall of whatever, machine you're using the wall or the wall of the desktop however you want it or you could use use the mount on top to mount it from the top i'm personally going to use the mount on top it's just easier for me i like it better and just i don't want to screw i don't want to make holes on the wall because if i decide i don't want to use this mount anymore i'm going to have the holes on the side so i'm gonna, at least underneath the desk you're not even going to see the holes so i'm going to use these mounts right here as you see, if you loosen this screw right here, you could tilt the, the PC any direction you want. So like I said, you can mount it. If you want to mount it on the wall like this, you could. You want to turn it, you can turn it. However you want, guys. It all depends. All right. And another thing that I did want to show you on this one is this part right here. This is the front mount. This is, a, this is going to hold the PC in place. The bottom of the PC is going to be here. So this is the stand for the PC so it doesn't go up or down you know stay there but how is it gonna hold in the front I mean personally I thought they would put like a strap but of course that looks that looks cheesy so they have this mount here which is you you take the screws on the side here loosen it up and then boom this adjusts this. so you just find the width of your PC and see which one works for you and put it there simple as that guys very 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 simple and pretty much that's it for for the review of this. I it's a great product. I think it is. So let me go mount it on the PC and show you how it looks. All right, be right back. Look how nice that looks, guys. That is the finishing look on the mount that I just reviewed and opened up for you guys. I finally finished hooking it up there, and since so now it's off the desk, so it looks beautiful. Look how beautiful that thing looks, just right there. Look how nice that looks off the floor but under the desk 
that is ideally spot that's the ideal spot for me i think just because i have since i have such a long desk you know i have the space underneath and i can still have so much room i was able to put my desk my um print on the side of back over there since i got rid of the desktop i just made so much more room there for me i was able to leave my laptop there as well look at that look how beautiful that is look at that outcome you're gonna see my on uh, my headset there that's from gaming but look 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 how beautiful look, it still gives you room on top so it has breathing room for the pc when it breathes through the, the top and then as well as breathing room on the bottom i don't know if you can see it too well there but it, i'm gonna get closer so you can see that there is look how look how look how much space there is just because i have a higher desk you know so Depending on how much space you get here is how much space you get uh, depends on the space on your desk You know how, how high it is Because since you see there's only a small gap on the top is about maybe I want to say four inches three to four inches of space on top But it's enough for it to breathe. I got my headphones there My my headphone um, What's it called? Mount so it looks good there I got my audio jack there, so when I want to plug in my headphones in there, when I'm listening to everybody online, or if I want a game, I just plug it in there and play it off the PC. And of course, it gives you enough space in the back. Look at that. Back there, I got all my wires tucked in. It's not the best, but it keeps everything out of the way, so it looks more organized. So I can always, always put a little board back there, like a vented board, so it looks cleaner. But it's okay, I don't need all that. As long as it's covered, because if you look from the outside, well, besides that little wire bubbling out, it's all covered back there. I have the PC to lit it up because it's just so you can see the light. But other than that, it looks really clean. And so guys, that is the finished outcome. All right, guys, so you saw it installed. You saw the unboxing. I hope you guys like this video. So you see how much space I have. I showed you up close with the camera and everything to show you the mounted there with the headphone jacks here. And as you can see, I still have space here to keyboard and still keep on the side. So I hope you like this review. I hope somebody is in need of this like I was. That's the reason why I did this review because you never know who's going to want to use this and they're not too sure about it. Hopefully this will make your decision if you want to use it or not. Up to you. But I hope you liked this video. If you did, guys, go ahead and give me a big old thumbs up. And again, make sure you share this video so everyone's aware of this great product review I just did today. And guys, do not forget to leave a comment below if you have any questions, comments, questions, anything I do on this video or any of my other videos. And guys, I will leave a link below so you can go ahead and purchase it. I'll leave a link where I got it from. I did get it from Amazon, so it will be listed down below. Or I, I don't know. I'm pretty sure they sell this on Amazon, but I don't know if I bought it on Amazon or eBay. Can't remember exactly. Pretty sure I did buy it from Amazon because I usually buy everything from Amazon unless I find it cheaper. But I will leave a link to where you can buy this below. Um, and we'll leave it like that, guys. I think that's all I think of for today. Again, thank you so much for watching. And guys, don't forget to sh like, share, comment on all my videos to help support the channel. And if you haven't done so already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And again, if you want to help the channel just a little bit more, you know, it, oh, it all comes a lot, a little help comes a long way for us to do stuff like this, part of reviews, you know? So if you do, it's always appreciated, but never require. You're always, you are welcome to make a small donation to the channel if you choose to. Um, I got those PayPal and Cash App links down below. And I, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time.